In this tutorial, you will learn how to add hyperlinks to interactive Google Slides. The first step is to open up a Google Slide. Once you've opened up your Google Slide, it's a good idea to name it. Then the next step is to change the format of the slide. So we can go over here to layout. And I like to start with a blank one. So here's a blank slide. The subject of today's hyperlinked um, interactive Google Slides is going to be the history of Versailles. I have a page here on the history of Versailles. And for your purposes, uh, whatever your content is, you find a good web page with some uh, history or whatever your subject is, English. I mean, you can use any site you want. Just make sure that you vet the site first and make sure that the information is correct and useful. First thing I want to do in order to make them uh, make the slides interesting is find a picture that I want to use to use on the slide. So I'll just come down here to a picture of Louis. And then I will save the image. We can save it anywhere. Um, but I'm going to save it to my computer. And I'm going to come back up here to my slide and I'm going to insert image. Okay, it's upload from this computer. And I just find the image of Louie that I saved. And there's the image. And I want to resize him so I can put some content in here. Okay, so there's Louie. In the center of the picture. And uh, you can make, uh, you know, this image, uh, the slide interesting. You can put a background in there. Um, there's all types of different things that you can do to make the slide a little bit more interesting. If I put background, um, we can go just like a light blue. You can do an image. You can do pretty much whatever you want, but this makes it a little bit more appealing. And the next thing I want to do is I want to insert a text box so I can put some content in here. And I'm going to name this, let's see, History of Versailles. And what I can do is I can center that. And then what I want to do is I want to add in some content that I can then hyperlink. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do just one basic question. Um, why was the palace of Versailles built? Make sure that my spelling is correct here. Okay. Then what I want to do is I'm going to put another text box here. And I'm going to put a active hyperlink in. So this is how I do it. So I go uh, click this link. You search the information. And answer low. Okay. So right where I put that, uh, click this link. Um, what I want to do is I want to go to the history of Versailles here. And I want to come up here to the URL bar and copy it. So I just copied um, this URL up at the top of the page I want the student to go to. Um, I'm going to put in a highlight link. And then come up here to the hyperlink button, which is this paper clippy looking thing. Okay. And then what, what you can do is you can change the text in this dialogue, meaning you can make it, uh, you know, any text that you want. I could put Versailles, I could put whatever, but I'm just going to make the, uh, the link word clickable. So I'm just going to here under the link, paste the website and then apply it. 
And then every time the student hovers over this link, they can be taken to Versailles. And that's how you do an interactive uh, Google slide with hyperlinks. Um, you can direct the kids out of the slides um, anywhere that you want them to go and then have them answer in the slides. Um, it's really very flexible and up to you.